Hi, I'm Jen Fidel, the Pack Mom, here to make your life as a pet parent a bit easier. Today we're talking about socks for dogs who have trouble on slippery floors. I have one of those dogs. Um, Abe is nine and he has a little bit of arthritis going on in his back knees. So sometimes on our hardwood floors or on terrazzo or tile, he is kind of slippery, especially in the back. Um, a good thing to do for senior dogs who may be having this trouble, or really any dog who might be slipping and sliding on whatever floor type you have, is to try a sock with a gripper on the bottom. You can find them really, really cute or just really functional, but I found that socks work better than like a true dog boot or true dog shoe. Uh, the dogs can usually still feel the bottom uh, of the floor with just a plain sock and get one with a nice little gripper. Some have more grip than others and uh, most importantly make sure that the top of the sock has enough uh, stretch and is secure enough so the sock doesn't slip off the bottom of the foot, which happens oftentimes with a lot of these products. Uh, another thing to consider, instead of a true sock, like cotton sock, there's a couple of products on the market that use rubber. Uh, these are typically like a rubber swimming cap, if you've ever used one of those, but it's for your dog's feet. And talk about secure around the ankle. These socks are super, super snug. So usually they fit pretty well and they're thin enough that uh, your dog can still feel the bottom of the floor and doesn't feel like it's something so unnatural to them. Uh, so this is a good thing to try. Other than using socks for dogs who have trouble with slippery floors, you might just want to trim their nails and make sure the hair in between their paw pads is kept neat and trim as well. Because sometimes those are really the only culprit causing your pet to slip. I'm Jen Fidel, the Pack Mom, talking about socks for dogs who have trouble on slippery floors. I hope it helped you today. Thanks for watching.